Okay, this will probably be a couple part video. I'm installing the track and automatic rotation motor. And it's kind of, it's easy, but it's just a, a step process that'll take too long to film all in one. So I'll probably do this in a couple parts at least. First thing you just press the two-sided tape, very sticky stuff, so I don't, I don't have any uh, fear that that's not going to work. Um, I clean the surface underneath, you know, I clean this surface underneath the tape first, wiped it down real good. It says make sure the surface is clean, which makes perfect sense. So I scrub that, and I put the one side of the two-sided tape down. My next step is to peel the outside layer of the two-sided tape off the, the little film and then you push uh, this let me get the gear out of here this is the track that the gear hits and you you push this up against the two-sided tape and I'm going to clean that real good as I go and then I'll push that in place and I'm going to um, make it as tight as I can. I don't want it to be loose and wiggly as it pushes, so I'm going to keep it flush up. And when I get finished, maybe even try and squeeze an extra eighth of an inch or quarter of an inch in there so it, you know, it kind of pushes the ring itself up against the two sided tape instead of pulling it away as the gear hits it. I want to make sure I got every bit of outside pressure on this as possible to keep it in place. Um, I have not read online anywhere that this is a problem, so I'm, I'm confident this will work. Um, I just want to make sure I get it right the first time so I don't have to keep doing it over. <laughs> you know, this is part one. I'll let you know what happens when I'm done with the putting on the the uh, gear t uh, plastic. Thanks.